Hello everyone, so I'm making another video with my daddy-o here, and I did a tag not too long ago, it was called the Meet My Mom tag, and it was basically a tag where you ask questions to your mom about yourself, and it kind of helped your subscribers learn more about your mom, or learn more about your relationship with your mom or something, I don't know, um, but I thought that it would be a good idea to do the same tag, but with my dad, so... I'm going to make my own little tag here and call it the meet my dad tag instead of meet my mom. So yeah, I'm just going to ask my dad the questions and he's going to answer them for me. So the Okay, first question. What was I like as a child? He was a pretty cool kid. I mean, like how would you describe my personality as a child? Uh, he liked watching a lot of uh, cartoons like Elmo and... We need to poo. You weren't too bad of a kid. He was little, nothing. You always wanted your binkies, your passes. I always liked being like to myself, and I feel like I kept to kinda, myself. Kinda, was kinda, kinda, he was kind of quiet a little bit, but I mean, you kind of stayed to yourself in your room sometimes. But father, like father than that, you was okay. I feel like I was a pretty good kid. The second question was, what do you think of me making YouTube videos? Pretty cool. Three. Gonna be bored all the time. <laughs> yeah. Three was what's something funny I did when I was younger. Mm -hmm. Something funny I did when I was younger. I have something in mind. Like a funny moment you can remember me doing when I was younger. Something I did when I was younger that was funny. <laughs> you kind of bite on your. Sometimes in the story you bite on your sister. You know? I would buy her. I remember that too. Why, that was probably like the only bad thing I did when I was a kid. I got into like this phase where I wanted to like bite everybody. Like I wanted to like bite their arms and like their legs and stuff. Like I don't know why I did that but I wanted to bite everything. I know one time you ran into the... That wasn't really funny but you ran into the bed. And knocked it's your, funny about, now. Knocked, you, knocked yourself out. It's funny now, whenever it first happened it wasn't all that funny, but whenever now, looking back at it, it was kind of funny, because I was like running through the hall, that was what I was thinking about too. You slid, I think you slid or something. Went right I was running, I was hyper or something, at the time. and I ran into the theater test, and I made a video about that too, so if you guys haven't seen it, I'll leave it uh, down below so you can go check it out. The question was, it was a made for your mom, really, and this question's kind of hard for you to answer, because you're a guy and you don't wear makeup and it was like have you learned anything about makeup and beauty from me um we can change it to like i don't know like have you learned anything about like horror from me or like from working in a haunted house or something like that. yeah i mean i learned a lot but you you gotta put a lot of dedication in. it's kind of like bring you out of some of your shyness, shyness a little bit yeah i feel like this too has kind of brought me out of my shyness a little bit because like when I first started out, like, I was kind of, like, I don't know, I held a lot of stuff in, and, like, now I just feel like I'm, like, myself, and, like, people don't care. People people that watch my videos like my videos. So five, what's a weird habit of mine? I know one. I'll let you know. <laughs> uh, for me, a weird habit, and I've never really talked about this much on, like, my videos and stuff, but for me, a weird habit is... I always have to ask people if they wash if they wash their hands before they touch my food. Like if they're gonna make me something to eat, I have to make sure that their hands are clean. Like him all the time. Like if he's making me like a sandwich or something, I'm like, are your hands clean? I, I think it's long with some too. <laughs> weird habit, but I guess I guess it's normal. I guess, but she kind of like inspects the food. She looks it over and everything. Look, I've got to make sure it. that there's nothing in it before she's, I stick it into my mouth. She's inspecting. <laughs> Okay, number six was, if you had to rename your daughter, what would you name her? What is, like, another name that you would name uh, me if you could go back in time and rename me? Maybe Melody, because you always want to, you said, why didn't you name me, Me? why didn't you name me Melanie, Melody, instead of Melanie? Because everybody thought that my name was Melody, instead of Melanie, like, every time somebody would write my name on, like, a birthday card or something, they would always say Melody instead of Melanie, but, like, I've learned to, like, my name, I used to not like it. Your niece calls you Mimi. Mimi, because it was supposed to be like Mel Mel, <laughs> but she couldn't like pronounce pronounce it with the L's in there, so she just made it Mimi. When you guys go out to eat, what does she order? Come out with you. Me. 
Uh, most of the time it's Pizza <laughs> Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut or uh, Papa, Papa John's. John. I'm picky, you guys. I've never actually put that in a video before, but I'm really picky when it comes to food. What is one thing you wish you would do? <laughs> like, it could be anything. Get off my lazy butt sometimes and make my own sandwich or something. <laughs> Cause I'm always asking him to do me favors and make me a sandwich. You're trying to do a job. Maybe sometimes, you know, trying to maybe earn your own money sometimes. As far as that, I mean, I ain't, I ain't trying to rush you or anything. Like looking and like I'm trying to find a job, but I don't want to like get something that's like. You know, something that I feel like I settled for. That's the reason why I think I take such a long time. Really, truly. <laughs> yeah. Like, and I want to make sure I'm happy with it. be stuck with it for the rest of your life. What's something I do that annoys you? One thing you just talked about earlier. Like, Daddy, fix me something to drink. Daddy, Daddy just make me a sandwich. Daddy, <laughs> Daddy, go get my blanket out of my room. What's something I obsess over? Have a session with. Mm -hmm. Or something that I do, like on a daily basis, that I kind of obsess over. Uh, take, I'm taking a lot of showers. <laughs> I've always got to make sure I'm clean, so I'm always afraid I'm going to smell. I mean, don't get it wrong. There's nothing wrong with taking showers or nothing. But I take a shower like every <laughs> single day. Uh, where would you like to see me in ten years? I'd like to, I mean, I'd like to see you know a few points to get own money and stuff. Yeah. Settle on you know your own, find somebody that you know truly likes you for who you are, not just for you know their own reasons. Yeah, right. I'm happy. But with I mean, if she wants to be on her own, that's that's her own priority. <laughs> I feel like people kind of see them as like all they need, like a husband, or they need like to be married or something. I kind of feel like you don't like to be happy. Like if you're like happy on your own or whatever, like, then you should be. I, I kind of feel like I'm I'm gonna be like alone for the rest of my life with like a bunch of cats and I'm gonna be like a crazy cat lady, but I'll be happy. I won't be sad. When were you the most proud of me? It's kind of like last year, last year because you accomplished accomplished a lot of your goals. Like you you know you had a little little temporary job and and uh, you got to go a couple places that you never been to. Before. That I always so, wanted to go like Trans Allegheny. Yeah. What's the worst thing I've ever done? Maybe one time back top mommy or something. <laughs> I feel like everybody does that though when they're little. Maybe like whenever I was a little kid. I don't know if I ever mentioned this in the video before either. But when I was a little kid and my mom would make me something that I didn't want to eat. I, instead of telling her mom I don't want that. Like I would throw it in the trash can and then I'd put a bunch of stuff over top of it. Like she wouldn't find okay, it. Whatever. And then like she would go and she would uh empty the trash or whatever and find it and then she'd be like, Melanie, what did you do? That's probably like one of the worst things I've ever done. Uh, what's your favorite moment of us together? Well, every, every day is a favorite moment with you. I think it's just mainly like the ghost hunting and like, like the haunted house. Haunted house. Yeah, scare view. Working in them together and stuff. How was I in school? I think I was a pretty decent yeah. kid. My friend dared me to put uh, juice into her refried beans, and then our principal came along. And our principal was mean, anyways. But she like came along and she said, "You just made a big old mess." And she like sent me to the principal's office, and I ended up like going to the bathroom and waiting, and then she like forgot about it. And then she left a letter in my locker like the next day or something or another, and wanted me to give it to my parents and have them sign it. And I gave it to my friend, and my friend took it home and shredded it, and like they never seen it. <laughs> so they didn't know that I got sent to the principal's office at one point. <laughs> now you know. Would you, would you just do it just to get in trouble? Or no, we didn't think she'd get <laughs> onto us because like we were emptying the food out anyways. Oh. But like we got in trouble for pouring juice into refried beans. But like we got in trouble for pouring juice into refried beans. Into refried beans. What would you change if you could raise me again? I don't know. I wish, you know, maybe could uh, do more things with you than I do, you know, have more more money than what I do, you know, to do, do more stuff. I mean, I think that I had a pretty good, like, decent childhood. Nowadays, like, we don't really get to go that many places as what we used to, but, like, when we were younger, like, we'd take, like, road trips and go to, like, amusement parks and 
stuff like that, and that was a lot of fun. We used to go camping with my papa all the time. I mean, I ain't saying that we don't do this stuff, it's just, you know. Not as often. Not as often as what we use this. <laughs> this is a funny question. I know what you're going to say. Describe my perfect type of guy. Like a guy you'd see me going for. Somebody's got... Somebody's got biceps and all <laughs> kinds of stuff. <laughs> Somebody it's I like a muscly. Mus muscular type guy. That's where all the uh, questions on the <laughs> Meet My Dad tag that I made. Um, if you guys haven't seen my Meet My Mom tag, I'll leave it in, this, in the description box below so you guys can go um, watch that if you haven't. That way you kind of get to know both my mom and my dad. And I've never really done this before. Like, I've made, like, short horror films and, like, other videos and stuff with my dad, but I've never made, like, something like this. And I really want to, like, start making more videos with my parents so you guys can, like, get to know them a little bit more. But, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a big old thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already and become a morbid maniac. Do this do this with your parents and make a video and then send it to me because I would love to see that. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.